Now at T plus 70 seconds into flight, vehicle is 4 miles in altitude, 0.2 miles downrange distance, traveling at 1,200 miles per hour. Mach 1, Alice is now supersonic. Vehicle is now passing through max Q, maximum dynamic pressure. The vehicle is now throttling down slightly. R180 engine parameters continue to look nominal after the prior adjustment to the thrust level. Approximately two minutes remain in the Atlas booster phase of flight. The Atlas V rocket weighs now just one half of what it did at launch, burning propellant at a rate of 2,600 pounds per second. Vehicle is now executing closed loop steering. Center 5 central reaction control system is now pressurizing the flight levels. We are now just under three minutes into flight. Atlas is 33 miles in altitude, 59 miles downrange distance, traveling at 5,600 miles per hour. All first stage vehicle systems are operating as expected at this time. The main engine is now throttling to maintain a constant 5G acceleration limit. Centaur has begun the boost phase chill down sequence. And the RD-180 is now throttling to maintain a constant 4.6 G acceleration limit. Boost phase chill down sequence has completed. And we have BICO, booster engine cutoff, and a successful stage separation event. Please start on the RL-10. Mess one, we have ignition for the first burn. We have indication of good payload fairing jettison. The PU system on the RL-10 is now in an open loop burn off mode to burn off excess fuel in the early portion of this burn. During this first burn, which will last just over nine minutes, Centaur upper stage will loft itself and the Lucy spacecraft into a parking orbit. I just received word from the performance group that the boost performance was better than expected. R10 performance looks good at this early portion of the burn. The 
Centaur reaction control system is performing as expected, seeing periodic firings to maintain thermal conditioning, and all line temperatures are approaching the bottle temperature. Five seconds. Spacecraft set. We have indication of successful separation of the Lucy spacecraft. With the successful separation of the Lucy spacecraft, the center will now perform a propellant blowdown sequence in order to inert the vehicle and complete today's flight. This will complete today's commentary of the Lucy launch. This is Atlas Flight Commentary signing off.